Welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be putting uh, MHD map on the M135i. We'll go through the process of how you flash the map and the steps you need to take to do that. So let's get into it. First thing we need to do is put the battery on the tender. So we've got this one, seems to do the job, and I'm gonna get it on tender, hook it up, let it charge up for a little bit, and then we'll get on with the flash. We're gonna get on with mapping. What you're gonna need is iPad, Ethernet to lightning cable, and an Enet cable. So I've got the Enet cable plugged into the car, plug that into the lightning adapter. I will plug that into there and we'll film on here as well. Um, I'll put it on the screen. Go into the settings and then you'll see an Ethernet button. Click on that. Click on the interfaces. Configure IP address. Manual. And it's going to be 169. And then the mask is going to be 255. Two five five zero 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 two five two five zero zero. Right. So we've got that in now. You don't need a router address, so we'll just save that, exit that, and then we'll go over now into the MHD app. So, so if we just turn off the Wi-Fi, it says activate new license key. And then in this box, what we do is we enter the code that they sent us, the VIN together. So you can see now we've got the super license for this car. So now, so the next step is we're going to apply the map onto the car. So what we'll do here is we'll click flap and flap. We'll click flash an MHD map. We need to put a seatbelt on. What we'll do is, because this is a race car. We'll put a 93 stage 2 plus on it so what you do is select the octane you want select the map you want and then select the gearbox type so now it's found the car go into the options these are all the options we can apply so we can have anti-lag no lift shift but that only works for cars with the manual gearbox you can um, you can enable on the M55 engine, you can enable the brat that the S55 engines have. Uh, but what we'll do for now is we'll just turn off cold start because it sounds awful. Go back into that. Now we'll just click long right and then it will start doing the mapping. While it's doing the mapping, you'll see the dash light up like a Christmas tree. Don't worry, once it's finished mapping, it'll do a code clearing after. We'll come back once it's finished writing. So now it's finished writing the map to the car, what it's going to do is it's going to clear all the codes off, restart the DNA, some other bits and bobs, and then what we need to do is just turn the engine. Uh, so now it's finished doing everything, it's turned the DME off, it's turned the ignition off. Now we just wait 30 seconds and then we can fire the car back up. watching our videos, like, share, subscribe, ring that bell.